All right, y'all, we in the building. Roll the intro! Another one, it's another one, and another one. What's poppin', y'all? We are back with another video. If this is your first time here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Don't be over here worried about what we got going on and you not subscribed. Subscribe to the channel right now. Make sure you like this video and turn the notification bell on so you don't miss the next time I drop another video. Okay, y'all, so we got to get right into it. I'm not going to keep y'all long. I ain't going to keep y'all long at all, child. So, look, Megan Thee Stallion, um, she had her concert tonight, which was sold out, by the way, um, in Madison Square Garden in New York City. And, y'all, she brought out her WAP sister, Cardi B. She brought her out. They did WAP together, and they did bongos. And then also, Glorilla joined them on the stage to do Wannabe. And y'all, um, that's not it. They are, Cardi B will be featured on the remix of Wannabe, which comes out this Friday. So, you know, um, so I want to start this video off by saying I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. I don't always get it right. I don't always get it right. Now, remember, just last week, I was telling y'all that I thought that Megan Thee Stallion was taking shots at Cardi B in the um the song boa and i did think that this was just me making a educated guess and piecing it together based on what i had heard i thought that she was taking shots at nikki but she was also taking shots at cardi b y'all i was wrong i was wrong now that's the thing about me if i was wrong about something i'm gonna get on here and i can admit yeah i was wrong about that i got i got it wrong on that one y'all so i did get it wrong on that one it looks like the girls are um they are on good terms cardi b and megan the stallion are on good term so this is amazing this is awesome to see um i'm interested to see so now that i know that they're on good terms i wonder if um we'll get another collab from the the two maybe we can finally get one for megan's new album because i feel like cardi b has had the um the wop and the bongos and i don't know if the, those will go on her projects but those are kind of like her as the lead artist so i wonder if cardi b and megan have something coming up for her album um, you know, I'm interested and I'm also interested to see um how Cardi B is gonna mesh on that wannabe. You know, wanna be saying no same uh, that is not my nigga no same uh. Remember I told y'all that song grew on me, so I like it. So y'all, but that gag the hell out of me. Let me get the video pulled up. Because y'all know I was on here running my mouth, bumping my gums last week. Um and I'm like, I don't think they're cool no more. I thought she was taking shots at Cardi in the song or whatever. But it turns out that she was not, y'all. She was not. Um, or maybe she still could have been. You never know. Meg is a little shady. Um, maybe she still could have been. I don't know. But either way it goes, they are on good terms. The girls are getting along. Um, I actually love to see it. Hold on, y'all. Oh, okay. I got to make sure. Um, contrary to popular belief and what you guys might think. I actually like seeing um, them get along. Um, and just the girls in general, like the rap girls, I actually do like seeing them get along. And let me tell you why. Because when they get along, then um, the, we get good music out of it. So that means that... Now, of course, who doesn't want the mess? Of course, do I want the mess? Do I want to hear the bars going back and forth? Come on now, like let's be for real. I, lo I love... You know, when they do get into it, too, because it's content for us to talk about, and it's a little messy. But um, a pair like Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion, that's not something that I want to see a breakdown with their relationship or anything like that, because we got some good records from it. You know, we got the WAP record, the rock, WAP record. It broke a lot of records, and it was a really good record. Bongos fell a little flat for me. So they made good music together. So, you know, um, I'm happy. I'm happy that they're uh, on, on one accord and getting along and everything. But it just gagged me because I just knew and nobody could convince me otherwise that Megan Thee Stallion was not throwing shade at Cardi B. I had it made up in my head. I had it all figured out. I'm like, she's going for her. And I was wrong. I was wrong, clearly, because Megan Thee Stallion brought her out. So I was wrong, y'all. Let me get this video pulled up so I can show y'all. But um, hold on really quick. Let me get it pulled up. Hmm. So, shout out to Malago Grams. That's where I got this video from. Um, okay. This is... 
So she's doing wob. Y'all know I can't play it all. That's Cardi. There's Cardi B. There's Cardi B. She looks amazing. Got the black corset. The, the, the girls are out. The boobs are boobing. But yeah, y'all, I just wanted to get on here and talk about that really quickly because, y'all, it gagged me. I got to be honest, that gagged me. I was not expecting to see those two together. I thought that they were on the outs at the moment. So, uh, but nonetheless, I'm happy to see the WAP sisters are reunited on stage. Um, y'all know we're going to be checking for that. Um, we're going to be checking for that wannabe remix on Friday, too. I'll let y'all know my thoughts on that. Um, we know there's not going to be a video because they already kind of did the video. Or maybe there will be. Maybe they'll go back in and do another video. Who knows? They probably... Uh, who knows? You know? I don't know. But I think it's good for Cardi B to... Um, I think it's good for Cardi B to, you know, get this momentum back on her. You know, I told you that, you know, the momentum around her was dying down. And I still stick to that. But it's good for her to go ahead and jump on a remix. Especially the wannabe song is um, still on the charts right now. And it's been on there for um, about a month now. And so, uh, I'm sure with Cardi B jumping on the record, it's going to bring it back up there and throw it back in the algorithm. And they may even go top 10, um, depending, you know, if everybody shows up. So, this could be a really good win for them and for Glorilla. This is really good for Glorilla, too, because she has Megan Thee Stallion and Cardi B on one of her records. So, that's huge for her. So, shout out to Glow on that, too. But let me know what y'all think about this video. Were you guys gagged when you saw Cardi B come on that stage? How are y'all feeling? But yes, I was wrong. I want to say I was 100% wrong. I can get on here and admit when I was wrong. I got it wrong that time. But I'm excited to hear what this song sounds like on Friday. So let me know what y'all think about um, Cardi B getting on a remix. Let me know what you think about seeing Cardi B on the stage. Megan Thee Stallion bringing her out at her sold out show in Cardi B's hometown um, in New York. I want to hear from y'all in the comments. Y'all know we're going to chop it up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, like this video, and turn that notification bell on so you do not miss the next time we drop a video. We got some heat coming. I'll catch y'all in the next one.